Welcome back. Today my goal is to ride to Girna, port city on the north coast of Cyprus. And from there, catch a ferry back to Turkey. Got a giant abandoned resort here. Let's have a closer look. Looks like a way in over here. Hmm. Let's find the stairwell. There we go. Is this an elevator shaft? Looks like it. Show apartment. Executive suite. Hmm. Could it be this? Executive suite. Hmm. That's very nice. Look at these dodgy bricks. Looks like they were building this place cheap. You want a mountain view or an ocean view? That's the question. Wonder why they stopped building this place. They run out of money? Or maybe it was an illegal construction site the government clamped down on. Okay, let's continue on our way to Girna. Apparently we've got the remains of an ancient city up here. This is the way. off-road. Oh wow. Ancient church over there. So it's all locked up. No way inside. Check out this very interesting piece of stone here. Looks like the ancients carved it into something. There's a way inside. Is this some kind of tomb perhaps? Wait a minute. Is this a military fence with the signs facing the other way? How'd I wind up on the wrong side of a military fence? You'd think there would be better security. Well, the ancient city's right on the other side, so I might just uh, hop this. Not gonna lie, this fence is kind of fucked up. It's probably a zone the military doesn't care much about at this point. Now where's this ancient city? Ooh, here we go. There's some rock cut tombs. So this is the ancient necropolis of Lambusa. That's the name of this place. Yeah. 
So apparently this is all from the Bronze Age. That's cool. So these are a bunch of carved Bronze Age fish pools. I suppose the idea was to trap fish in high tides and then fish them all out. Look at that. Bronze Age fish pool. You ever seen such a thing? This is quite a fascinating channel. What a nice network of channels and pools these Bronze Age people made. It looks like people are still utilizing them today. I don't know what's up with this forbidden zone. It looks completely perforated and ignored by the locals. So I'm going to follow their lead. Forbidden zone. Is this some kind of joke? Like look at this. Path just goes right around. Hopefully I don't have to ride out of here in a hail of bullets. Seeing as I didn't encounter anything on the way in, I'm pretty sure it's going to be okay. Just had to stop to check out this landing vessel. They would have stormed off this onto the beaches of North Cyprus. This must have been the beach where the landing took place. Beautiful. Nice view from up here. Look at these machine guns. Awesome. Here's the bridge. Nice. <laughs> nice. Back on the road. Nice military park back there. Okay, made it to Girona. Uncle Sam's American Eatery. Got my apple lime lemonade, my banana peanut butter milkshake and my southern fried chicken. Mm.
Mm -mm -mm. So American. Mm. That was nice. Approaching the port now. Well, that ferry was full, no available space. So I've booked a ticket for the one tomorrow. But in the meantime, I'm gonna check out the castle of St. Hilarion up in the mountains above Girna. St. Hilarion, 10 Ks. Is that Ataturk up there? Most likely. Alcohol. There it is, the castle of St. Hilarion. St. Hilarion's castle. Here we go. Sarnich, we got a cistern here. This place was built in the 11th century to defend the main road from Kyrenia to Nicosia. Byzantine church. Buttery. Is this where they made butter? Imagine all the churns sitting in here, churning up the butter. Had a very commanding view, helped protect Kyrenia from coastal raids. balcony for the royals if anyone was going to attack Kyrenia down there they'd know about it this is a very complex castle all kinds of little nooks and crannies they used up a lot of the available space here Middle-age privies. Oh, nice. Down to the gong farmer. Always wanted to see a real-life gong farmer.
congratulations, you are at the peak of St. Hilarion Castle. 732 meters. Nice. Although, I'm not at the peak. The peak is towering above me. So, this is a barracks. I love this overgrowth. It gives this castle such a vibe. Kitchen. Just imagine. Not much left of it now. Royal Apartments. There's jagged mountains out there. Well, I rode all the way down this coastline, around the end of those mountains. Wow, that is a beautiful window, the Queen's window. This castle really does have a commanding presence above Kyrenia. St. John's Tower. Prince John's Tower. Okay, let's head up to the peak. There it is, the summit of St. Hilarion. Screw that! There's the Girna Castle, and there's the modern port where I'll be catching my ferry tomorrow. And then off it goes.